What's good? It's your boys have money, and today I'm gonna talk about transgenders and how they are considered male and female in the age of Aquarius and the New World Order and stuff like that. And how transgenders from female to male to male to female who are ch switching their genders and stuff are full flesh considered male and female. You know what I'm saying? So <clears throat> what I'm trying to say though is is that you no, know, you're not gay for for liking transgenders. There's no such thing as being gay by liking transgenders. You feel me? If you a male trying to a female that that was born a male, but she's a full fledged female, she looked dead like a female, do all the surgeries and stuff like that. Even her feet is feminine. There's nothing wrong messing with that particular female. You gotta understand that transgenders are a part of the society, you know what I'm saying? Just like Jewish people, you know, the LGBTQ have power as well, got power as well. Same thing with the Jewish people, you know what I'm saying? These people got power, man. So when it really come down to it, liking a transgender doesn't mean you're gay. You feel what I'm saying? So, and that's one thing I want to say. You know what I mean? Hold on, y'all, because I support the LGBTQ community. You feel me? I got, you know, don't get me wrong, I got some dark secrets in my past as well. Now, I'm not proud of that I did, but at the same time, I was sexually active. I was a kid, and I couldn't find no, you know, nothing. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not going to go into detail, but you know what I'm trying to say. You know what I'm saying? The whole thing. I mean, it might happen to all of us when we was kids. We might have done some gay shit in, in, our, in our childhood life, and... You know, looking back at it, we like we regret it and stuff like that. But hey, it is what it is. You know, what I'm saying I got some skeletons in my closet as well. But the thing about it is, I don't, I don't discriminate. You know, what I'm saying I got a lot of love for the LGBTQ community. You know what I'm saying? And I do like transgender females. I do like males who have transformed to a female, or basically a male born as a person born as a male, but now as a female. You feel what I'm saying? Hold out yards. So I don't discriminate against the LGBTQ. Like I said, they got power. Just like the Jewish people, they got power. You know what I'm saying? You living in their society. Here in America, America is heterodoxy. It's not orthodoxy. You know what I'm saying? America society is full-fledged heterodoxy. You know what I'm saying? And then it's going to become a secular society once people create their own mythologies and stuff like that and bring gods and goddesses into existence. So what I'm basically trying to say, though, is, is that, yes, I am attracted to transgenders, you feel me? I am attracted to transgenders, you feel me? I'm saying the, the finest transgenders out there are Asian transgenders, because when Asians turn to self to females, they be looking dead like females. I'm not saying all of them, but majority of them, especially the lady boys in Southeast, A Southeast Asia, you know what I'm saying? Lady boys, you know what I'm saying? They, they look dead like females, you feel what I'm saying? Whole nine yards, so... What I'm basically trying to say though is, is that here in this in this in this postmodern era, you know, we're getting close to the new world order. The thing about it is, is that the LGBTQ and the Jewish people, those are the main people that's going to have power once the you know, once this world reached the age of Aquarius by 2030. You feel what I'm saying? And also by 2030, you know, gen, ginger genderless is going to be added. And people can identify as not being gender at all. You feel what I'm saying? So what I'm trying to say is, is that when it really come down to it, I'm, I'm attracted to females. I love females, but also I'm attracted to transgender females as well. Male who have transformed to a female, and that's not being gay. That's not being gay. Out. Being gay is when you with the opposite sex, with the same sex that the same person that you with. You know what I'm saying? Person that is transgender, person that is transgender though, like a, a female that was born a person that was born a female, but now it's a male, and a male that was a person that was born a male now is a female. You gotta understand they are, are they are officially now male and female. You feel what I'm saying? They are officially now male and female here in this heterodoxy society. You know what I'm saying? So that's one thing. So in the coming new world order. People who are straight have no choice but to accept, you know what I'm saying, transgender and mess with transgender. Because trust and believe, once these uh, males, you know, turn themselves to females, they're going to look dead like females. And it's going to shock you to the point where you won't realize it. What I'm trying to say, though, is, is that there's going to be more transgenders in the society than there are regular born people, if you get what I'm saying. What the thing I'm trying to say, though, is, is that... You, there are transgenders out there that look dead like females and act just like females. Also got big booty, big titties, all that stuff. You feel me? Whole nine yards. So what I'm trying to say though is, is that 
when it really comes down to it, you're going to end up messing with a transgender, even if the penis is on or off. It's still, you know, you're still going to mess with a transgender. You feel what I'm saying? On our yards. So what I'm basically trying to say, though, is, is that, you know, I had no problem messing with a transgender female. You know what I'm saying? Holding our yards. You know what I'm saying? As long as she's thick and got sexy feet and all that, I don't have no problem messing with a transgender female. You feel what I'm saying? Holding our yards. Because they are considered females. I know I know y'all wondering, like, man, you gay as fuck, you a faggot, all this other stuff. Y'all can say whatever the hell y'all want to say. You feel me? But this is YouTube, and this is how YouTube is right now. YouTube support those who support people who's who's who support you know the the LGBTQ and Jewish people and even Asians as well. You know what I'm saying? The whole thing is the whole thing about it. Even though I don't got a lot of subscribers because I don't tag my video or do anything, and I don't put ads on my video either. If you see an ad, that's YouTube. But the thing about it is I don't make money on YouTube. You feel what I'm saying? I'm doing this for free, basically. I'm doing this for free. But I have this account since 2008. You know what I'm saying? Since 2008. So what I'm basically trying to say, though, is, is that, no, I'm not a homosexual. I am straight. It's just that, you know, transgenders, you know, whether you like it or not, they are considered female, and you got to treat them like females, and you got to embrace them like females. Same thing with, with females that want to become males, you got to embrace them as males. So what I'm basically trying to say, though, is, is that, yes, I do got a thing for transgenders, but I am straight, though. I do like women, though. I do like pussy, though. Know? You feel what I'm saying? But hold on you But at the same time, I, got to, I have to accept that I got to accept the transgenders as females as well. And also, I cannot discriminate. You know what I'm saying? Because at the same time, they want to get their female, femaleism validated. You know what I'm saying? Get their femaleism validated. You know what I'm saying? So, what I'm basically trying to say, though, is, is that when it really comes down to it, you know, that's what I'm about. My philosophy includes a, a whole bunch of uh, LGBTQ to be a part of it. And also, I created a pass for specifically for the LGBTQ community to be a part of and stuff like that. So, I'm, you know, I do support the LGBTQ community. You know what I'm saying? I do support them. You feel I do support, you know, all of them. You know what I mean? And I do like transgenders as well. You feel what I'm saying? Because that's the society that we live in. We live in a heterodoxy society. The society, you know what I'm saying? So that's one thing I want to say. So this is your boy Tamalane. That's all I want to say. That's all I want to put out there. You feel what I'm saying? And I know you want to. What made you want to come up with this video? The simple fact is, is that Pride Month was in June, and I didn't put this video out in June. You feel what I'm saying? So the thing about it is that the transgenders, whether they're born female, born male, but transform to a male or female, are considered male and female, man. Whether you like it or not, you gotta accept it. You gotta accept them into your life. You feel what I'm saying? If you if you like females, and you gotta mess with transgender females. If you a male, you gotta mess with uh, fe um, females that will turn to a male and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Holding our yards because being gay, being gay is like if you like the opposite sex. Transgenders are not the opposite sex. They're actually who they say they are. They are full fledged male and female. And that's all I gotta say. This is your boys have money.